is your healer. Worship him for who he is. He's our redeemer. He's our God. He's our God. He's our heavenly father. Worship him. Worship him. Worship him. None beside him. He's a great God. He's a great God. He's a great God. That's all I know. He's a great Don't be tired of worshiping our Maker. He's a great Give him praise. Give him praise. Give him praise. He's a great We came here to worship him. We came here to worship him. That's all I know. He's a great He's the one that fight our battles for us. No like him, no like him. That's all I know. No like him, oh, no like him. He's a great, great, great God, God, God. God have a say, yeah. Oh, that's all I know. He's a great. Battle. Worship him, don't be tired of worshiping your maker. He deserves worship. He deserves our worship today. All the glory must be to the Lord. For he is walking on the plane. In Jesus' name we worship. You have given him worship. Now he is here. He is here. Why did you leave your house to come here today? What prayer request was in your mind when you decided today I will not sleep in my house? Oh, Jesus Christ, very loud. Take any prayer position, but don't keep quiet. If you keep quiet, you will go back without a testimony. But if you open your mouth, whatever you ask him to do, he will do it. His mercy is here now. His glory is here now. Very loud. Once, Lord Jesus Christ, shall we go? Prayer, prayer, prayer. Why are we here?
Jesus name we pray in Jesus name we pray now this three or four prayer points I want to give you now I want you to take it very seriously that deliverance that God has wrought when he exposed that bottle with that pin with that padlock that oil inside there something is written prophetically and put in a cock and closed like that church every one of us here as that bottle was broken that nonsense was exposed any evil prophetic action against you today it is over now we are going to pray that pin that pin that pin it signifies something anything they pin down does it move forward can it be loose it remains stagnant every pin spiritual pin physical pin that the enemy has used to keep me stagnated so that my life will not move forward i will not achieve my ambition i will not reach where god has destined for me father make reference to what he did as you remove this one here yesterday lord remove the one concerning me in my village under the earth anywhere you know you know you see what we cannot see shout his name lord jesus Christ, very very loud and pray that prayer point shall we go Open your mouth and pray, pray. Every pin, pin in my life. Loose, 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 loose. Scatter it to pieces, Lord. God of Elijah, send down fire. 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 O God of Elijah, send a fire. 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 In Jesus' Christ, then we pray. There was a padlock there. They locked the padlock. They put the pin there, like this. This is how they did it. You see? This is how they did it. We are going to pray. Anywhere my glory has been locked. Open your mouth and begin to open it. 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 Holy Ghost, 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 Holy
Jesus name we pray every door that has been locked against me every door of blessing Lord open it open your mouth and open every door say it if you come to pass say it Every door that has been closed against me. You tell me, you tell fire, 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 you tell me, you tell me, you tell fire, 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 you tell me, you tell fire. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' Christ's name we pray. That padlock that has locked you today has been opened. That pin that they pin you down has scattered to pieces. Because they locked all the doors of blessing and pinned your progress down, that's why your life has been full of bitterness. Symbolized by bitter cola that they put there. We are going to pray. Lord, hallelujah. Psalm, there's a scripture, a prayer that the psalmist said in Psalm 119 verse 49, verse 50 and verse 50. He said, remember the word unto thy servant, upon which thou hast caused me to hope. This is my comfort in my affliction, for thy word has quickened me. He said, remember the word unto thy servant, upon which thou hast caused me to hope. What is the promise of God for you that you have been waiting for? Through dream, you saw it. Everywhere you went, they prophesied to you. In bride assembly, they prophesied. You read it in the scripture, it was speaking to you. You confess it every day. Today is the last confession. Lord, remember, you promised me. Remind God of his promise concerning you. Tell him to hasten to perform it. Tell him to hasten to perform it. Open your mouth and begin to pray somebody. You promised me, Lord. You promised me. In a dream, you promised me. In a prophecy, you prophesied to me. Precious God, no tender voice like thine can please our oh, I need thee, oh, I need thee. Every I need thee. Let me see that I your I come. Savior, 
I go to connection to contact your blessing. Hallelujah. You don't know where that connection will come from. And it will not be a 419 connection. A divine connection that will lead you to your testimony. Will lead you to your breakthrough. You will shout his name, Lord Jesus Christ, very, very loud. Because that is the name of our God. When you shout that, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Okay, okay, okay. Shout that name, Lord Jesus Christ, very loud. And then tell him, grant me divine connection. Divine, divine connection. It can be in every, any area of your life. In every area. One young girl here, that one came one time for prayer. She was drying, Bangle drying, drying. She's not dry. Bangle, what is drying her? Nobody knew. She'll be coughing and coughing and coughing non-stop. Non-stop. This type of cough, non-stop. She did, she traveled to Germany for treatment. They couldn't stop travel everywhere. And I was praying for her and I told her, I said, what will bring your healing will just be one thing from where you don't even expect at all. She went to Abuja and went to patent medicine store. Patent, patent medicine store to buy something else. And she started that cough there. And the patent medicine seller, one Igbo boy that can hardly write his name, said, Auntie, what in the wrong like this? He said, <laughs> Don't worry. He said, I have it three times now. He said, He opened this container, brought some out. Open another container, brought some up. Put another container. He said, take 100 naira. She said, what is this? He said, this is the solution to your problem. He said, then she remember Pastor Moses said, now one simple thing will just happen. She said, okay. She gave 100 naira. She drank that medicine and that was the end. <laughs> Hallelujah. She was giving me this She said she does fit. She doesn't know the name of what she said. They were all in containers. You know this medicine in the pool. She op he opened, bring four here, open three here, bring this one here, pack and together. I said take. He said the thing will go. There shall be divine connection for you to receive a solution. Hallelujah! Something you have been looking for, God will connect you to where you will get it. Lord, give me divine connection. Open your mouth and pray somebody. Lord Jesus, give me divine connection. Jesus, give me divine connection. You know what you are looking for. Tell the Lord, I need connection for this. I need connection for this. Give me this connection, Lord. Connection for my market. Connection for my supplies. Connection for contract. Connection to receive my payment.
Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Finally, everybody stand up. Hallelujah. There are two names you are going to call now. When you shout the blood of Jesus Christ, the first one we are going to do is anybody you are expecting favor from. Blood of Jesus, speak for me. Then you will shout the person's name or the people's name if they are more than one. Your brothers, where they overseas, where they block them, may they not see you. After this night, they will locate you. Hallelujah. Do you, do you believe that something will happen? There shall be a performer of it because you believe it. Anybody you know you are looking for favor from? Eh? Anybody you are looking for favor from? Just shout the name with your eyes closed and keep quiet. Lift up your right hand before God. The other hand on your chest. My father, my God, this is a prophetic action. Today's time is short because of environmental. So we were rushing. And some prophets, their eye, they do win, win, win. They want to give message. Father, search the whole world. Father, any name they will mention now, whatever they are looking for from that person, Father, let that person release it in the name of Jesus. For that favor to flow, blood of Jesus Christ, speak for me, shall we go? Shout the name. I didn't say you should pray. Just call their names or the name. Just call the name once, that's all. If they are four, call them one by one, their names, and keep quiet. I didn't say you should pray. This is now time for action. Blood of Jesus Christ still speaks. Still speaks now. Blood of Jesus Christ still speaks now. This sister is drawing my spirit. Come. Touch her. Come. Have I prayed with you before? Yes. I prayed with you before. Yes. How, when? How long ago? Last two years. Two years ago. Yes. You do sports? Yes. You do sports? Your time has come. Amen. Eh? Your time has come. Amen. Somebody shout, my time has come. My time has come. And I know they hear English. Me, my own, my own time. Oh. M me, my own, my, say my time. All of you say my own, my. I mean my own, my own. Nobody will steal your blessing from you in the name of Jesus. Once more, the name of the people you are expecting blessing from, whether they are here or not, by next Friday, you will come here with testimonies. Blood of Jesus Christ, speak for me very loud with that hand lifted up to the source of our power. The third heavens. Blood of Jesus, speak for me. Shall we go? Shout that name. Divine favor. 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 Divine favor.
Put down your hand. That name you have called now, you don't wake up now if you didn't sleep. Now you go just day in mind now. Now you go just day in mind now. Now you go just day in mind now. Now, anybody that you suspect has been troubling your life, has been troubling your family, troubling your business, troubling your education. Your school finished, the man no one release your result for you. Whoever, wherever, whether or not your landlord, or even if the names are five, but only you get five names, now you get problem. Anybody, now your uncle, you suspect, even if not just suspect, you don't suspect. If he's not guilty, nothing will happen to him. Hallelujah. But if he's guilty, hey, 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 hallelujah, hallelujah. Are you ready? The blood of Jesus Christ will go to that person and speak for you. And he, God, knows how to speak to everybody's enemy. Some he will bring stroke. Eh? Eh? Some, they will remove him from the seat. Some, six feet. Eh? Six feet. Eh? Some, the head, go colo. Eh? Do you believe it? Do you believe it? Who is that man? The Bible said, touch not my anointed. You have been anointed. You will be no go area for the enemy. Are you ready now? Please, this is a deliverance action for somebody here. I am a deliverance minister. When I talk, connect. Blood of Jesus Christ, speak for me very loud. Shall we go? Shout the name. I say, don't pray. I say, shout the name. That's all. Don't tell the Holy Ghost what to do. Amen. Amen. You have been praying, Lord, do this, do this, the thing, no work. Now we want to hand over the battle to him. Yes, Hallelujah. Amen. One more time. Just shout the name of the person where they trouble you. That's all. The angels that are here today, they are out to expose the enemy. Are you ready? Are you ready? Blood of Jesus Christ, speak for me. Shall we go? Shout the name of the person troubling your life. Hallelujah. Professor Sunday was, 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 was shouting Thomas. <laughs> he said, Pastor Thomas cut his allowance. <laughs> Whosoever it is, make a stand for my office. That is troubling anybody here. Spiritual or physical? Judgment is upon them today in the name of Jesus Christ. Every link between anybody here and the occultic kingdom, it is cut off today in the name of Jesus. I 
as you live here, as God exposed my own enemy today, he arrested the evil visitation. As you go back tonight, the Lord will expose the evil visitation. From today, today the anointing that has been released on our behalf is the anointing of exposition of the enemy. hidden manipulation of the enemy against who shall be exposed in the name of Jesus. Every unfriendly friend around you shall be exposed in the name of Jesus. Christ. Every hidden manipulation done and hiding anywhere working against you shall be exposed in the name of Jesus Christ. It is freedom time. I say it is freedom time. My name is Mr. Friday Oti. As the prophetess was prophesying in the screen, a voice came to me that our pastor should read Numbers 14, verse 14. And I'm going to read it now. Numbers 14, verse 14 says, And they will tell it to the inhabitants of this land, for they have heard that thou, Lord, art among these people. That thou, Lord, art seen face to face. And that thy cloud standeth over them. And that thou goest before them by daytime in a pillar of a cloud. And in a pillar of fire by night. Anywhere they take your name to. For evil, it shall be rejected in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Witches and wizards, occultic people, altars, evil altars, when they bring your matter, shrines, when they bring your name or your picture, the chief priest there will say, Hallelujah. Like Balaam told Balak, this one is blessed. It cannot be cursed. The world of darkness shall reject you in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Heaven answered, Amen. Heaven answered, Amen. Hallelujah. Do you want heaven to answer again? From today, your life will move forward in the name of Jesus Christ. From today, from today, from today, anything you lay your hand upon, it shall prosper in the name of Jesus Christ. Your hand or your waist. When I say I lose you to receive your blessings for divine connection all around, you know what to do? You know what to do? You will turn 360 degrees and face the altar again. By that action, anywhere they tie you, you will be loose. It is time to be loosed. Ready? Because this night is a night of release. It's a prophetic action. Make sure you participate. Make sure. It is funny but that is how God does with us here they know God is here that's why they are attacking us hallelujah 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 by 
by next, by, by the end of this year, eh? by the end of this year, all the single sisters here, every one of you that wants to marry, you will be in your husband's house. It is not an empty statement. Yes, sir. I am under the pillar of fire here. Yes, the pillar of fire is right here before me. Baba, if your eye they see, you go see him. Baba, I repeat. Every single sister here, no matter what age, but you have not married and you want to marry, by the end of this year, you will be in your husband's house. I want to say it three times. Once more, lift up your left hand, sister. Single sisters. Single, single. Those hands it is time to wear a wedding ring. Somebody shout, I claim my wedding ring. Say it, sister, say it. Say it, sister, say it. Say it one more time. Let heaven hear you. Let demon husband hear you. By this time, by the end of this year, by the end of this year, every hand that is up now, you will be in your husband's homes in the name of Jesus Christ. Receive your wedding ring. Receive your wedding ring. Receive your wedding ring. Receive them. Receive your own. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Whoever it is, take your own. Take your own. Take it. Take it. Nothing will stop it. Take it. It has been released according to the word of his servant. Take your own. Take your ring. All that hand that is off. Take it. Receive your own. In the name of Jesus Christ. Take your wedding ring. Take it. Take it. You must marry. Even if you are 60 years old and you never marry. 70 year old man will come and collect you. You must marry. You must marry. You are 50 years old, you never married. 30 something year old boy go say, Now nah you, you are married. If not be you, I go die. Now nah you. Do you believe it? Do you believe it? Your hand or your waist. By the prophetic action of turning 360 degrees and facing the altar, it is an action to lose yourself. Everybody, security coordinators. Everybody, pastors, whoever you are, under the influence of my voice, all the workers, our medical department, come out. Be a partaker of this special grace that is released here today. Hallelujah. Hey, thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Small, small, small fire is upon your heads. Upon your heads. Small, 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 fire, 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 like upon your head. I know it's a sign for somebody here. Because you have come here today, this special night, last Friday of the month of July, and God has decided that the wickedness of the wicked should come to an end tonight. You will enter the month of August peacefully in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. What you could not achieve from January to July, the month of August, you will achieve it. Amen. All the delays of your expectation from January until now, this month of August, you will receive it in the name of Jesus. Amen. Therefore, that 
my pronouncement shall come to pass according to the word of his servant. He said he will not let the word of his servant fall to the ground. He said he performed the counsel of his ministers. I did not call myself, he called me. And he who called me, he asked me when I pray. That the pronouncement I made that by the end of this year, all these single sisters here will be in their husbands' homes for it to come to pass. That your life will begin to move forward. That that slow progress forever is removed. And that for you to receive divine connection. Anybody here, a man or a woman or a demon or a shrine, or a covenant, or a curse, or an invocation, or an incantation, has tied any aspect of your life. Tied your business, tied your finance, tied your ministry, tied your destiny, tied your glory, tied your star, tied your education, tied your marriage, tied your brothers and sisters, your husband, your wife, tied your family members, tied your employment letter, Tie your visa. Tie you in any way to cause frustration in your life by this prophetic action of turning 360 degrees because you are here by the power of the Holy Ghost and His grace upon my life. I, Pastor Moses Alu, I lose you in the name of Jesus Christ. I lose you in the name of Jesus Christ. I lose you in the name of Jesus Christ. I lose you in the name of Jesus Christ. And who the Son of Man has set free? Are you free? Are you free? That amen is too paralyzed. I say hallelujah. Amen. Where is that lady that they collected your phone in the spirit? Come out. Amen. Come to the altar. Amen. Where are you? Quickly. Amen. Go ahead. Go. Amen. Do you believe that God has answered your prayers? You believe that the person that is troubling your life he, God, will expose that person. You believe it? If you believe that, can I hear your louder amen once more? Amen. You really fight battle. Hallelujah. When the prayer was going on, there is something I saw when my brother, brother Benjamin was giving the message. Is there anybody here you use NTN number, but it ended with 8813. 8813. It ended with 8813 Please check those sisters there. <laughs> Kamara ni buchi, amara ni buchi o, setia kage na rumo, amara ni buchi. Yes, so. Amara ni buchi, onye ne memale. Amara ni buchi mo, setia kage na rumo, amara ni buchi. Holy dear, I want to confirm something, ma'am. You use MTN number? Yes. Is this your first time of coming? 
your number ended with 8813. Yeah. I want to confirm. Are you from Abia State? Yes. Aruchuku? Yes. Come this side, ma'am. When the prayer was going on, I saw this number in the realm of the spirit. When my brother Benjamin was giving the message. I hear me, ma'am. The spirit of God ministered to me. I saw the person using this number comes from Abia State, from Aruchuku, and the person appeared to me like a banker. Huh? I'm a banker. Listen, ma'am. And when I saw the person like a banker, I hear me. And the spirit of God ministered to me that the husband of this person is not in Nigeria. All right. Listen. Right. I saw the husband of the person that owns this number. He appeared to me in the realm of the spirit. I see the person living in the U.S. Yes. Listen, ma'am. This is your message. The spirit of God ministered to me as the prayer was going on. I saw something like a mighty snake. Are you hearing me? Yes. Facing this particular man in the U.S. And when I saw this snake, it, the spirit of God ministered to me. I saw the attack coming from Anambra State. I hear what I'm telling you. He, he, he won't call me yesterday. He saw a snake in a dream that came to tie his leg. I hear what I'm telling you, ma'am. Yes, the Lord minister to me, I saw a snake facing this particular man in the U.S. And when I look, the snake was tying a man called C.J. All right, that's the snake. I hear me, ma'am. The Lord minister to me, as my brother, brother, uh, my brother Benjamin was giving the message, I was sitting down there, the Spirit of God spoke to me. Say that you tell your husband they want to paralyze him. I hear what I'm telling you. Yes. The same person that want to paralyze him, the spirit of God ministered to me. The same person went and paralyzed his father. Talk to the man. All right. Because in the realm of the spirit, I saw the father appear to me as somebody that be as if the left hand walk. is paralyzed. Yes, cannot walk. Listen, man. Thank God that you are here today. In fact, it's because of the, the, the snake your husband saw that made you to come for an IVG today. All right. <laughs> I'm going to change Nachi <laughs> You and your husband married two years ago. Talk to yes, the man. Yes. Thank you. I saw the two of you married two years ago, yes. 2009. Yes. And the Spirit of God ministered to me after you people got married. I saw a heavy miscarriage that you had, that 2009. Right. Huh? Yes. The Spirit of God ministered to me. The same snake again is the one that caused it. And is the brother to your husband father that is doing this thing. I know called Nemo. 
Are you hear what I'm telling you? Yes. Let me tell you something. This is what the Spirit of God showed me. I saw in front of your husband's house. Are you hearing me? Yes. In front of the house. They have two trees in front of the house. Yes. Listen. They have a tree appear to me like a pear. They have a tree that appeared to me like an orange tree. The Spirit of God ministered to me behind the two, the two trees. I saw something they buried in that particular spot. I hear what I'm telling you. Yes. And the Lord ministered to me, listen, when you go to the back of the house, you see a tank, like a water tank. Right. Listen, ma'am. The Lord ministered to me, say, the brother, after your father-in-law built that house, that is where the jealousy starts. I hear what I'm telling you. Yes. Uh -uh. I'm hearing a guy named Up Jesus. That's what they normally call him, the village Up Jesus. Hey! Hey! Give me a more Jesu, you more. Me a more Jesu, a gigi. Give me a more Guru Malaji. Jesu, see my more. I'm quite sorry. Emi omo Jesu imo, Emi omo Jesu agege, Emi omo guru malaji, Jesu ti momo apata ni aye. There is something the Spirit of God is ministering to me. The Lord ministered to me. Say I should tell you two things that He God answered your prayer this night, this morning. I mean. I saw where the Lord bless you with a baby boy. Amen. Are you hearing me? Your husband is planning to come back All right. this December. Yes, I saw him coming back this December. He wanted to come before the December, yes. but I saw him coming back this December. The Spirit of God ministered to me that tell your husband he should not be afraid. I hear what I'm telling you. Yes. That the snake they send that they want to use to paralyze him, that he God scattered that snake this night. Amen. <laughs> Listen. Be very careful the way you take any house help in your house. Are you hearing me? A woman is bringing a little girl, like 13 years, for you. Don't collect that girl. I saw the girl. The girl is possessed. Are you hearing me? Uh, uh. Somebody say power. There is a friend of yours God wants to bless. I saw a friend of yours in the realm of the spirit, walking in the bank. Thank you, Lord. Do you know anybody walking in the same bank with you? Call. I'll go to pronounce his name, sir. Kudi. Yes, my friend. Niwa lazy way. Niwa lazy way. Niwa lazy way. It's only I hear me, ma'am. Yes. Listen, ma'am. The spirit of God ministered to me. I saw this kudi, he appeared to me as if he's a do a do girl. Yes, sir. All right. The mother stays in Benin. Yes. Selling something like a somme. All right, yeah. Listen, go and tell, deliver this message to this sister. I saw where somebody is planning two things for the mother. Where the mother is selling. There is another woman by the side. Then this woman by the side is planning to poison the mother. Want to set something like a trap for the mother. I hear what I'm telling you. Yes. Tell that your friend, one day fasting and prayer. Tell the mother to do one day fasting and prayer. Okay. To cancel that nonsense. And after that fasting, it will return back to sender. 
Uh uh. Folista. Who is Folista? Faustina. Faustina. She's my friend too. He stays in Ajegule. Yes. Go and tell her that God has visited her with her husband. Okay. Are you hearing me? Let me not go forward again. Congratulations. Ikemi ikemo. The Lord has blessed you with a baby boy. Ikemi ikemo. Ikemi ikemo. Ikemi ikemo. Ikemi ikemo. Ikemi. Hallelujah. When the prayer was going on, I saw three people names where they went and reported three people names in Aguleri. In a shrine in Aguleri. And one of them, the Spirit of God was talking to me that one of them, you hold somebody money and truth, you were telling the person that you don't have money and truly you don't have money. The person did not believe you. He went and reported your, your name in a shrine in Aguleri. And I saw that shrine facing you. The Spirit of God ministered to me. I saw three people that God lose their name from a serious shrine. Listen. Listen. I want to let you know that the prayer you pray today, God answers it. So if you pray with your heart, thank him. He has answered your prayer. God bless you, church. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, God, Joe. Yeah, let's hear you now. I serve a nation God. Serve a nation God. I 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 serve a nation God. Amen. Amen. Church. If you believe that your request that you have presented before the Lord today has been answered, clap your hands together for Jesus. <laughs>